Hello, this is MicroJ101, and I'm going to be doing the first run of my brand new Sterling engine. So you guys are going to be the first ones to see it running. So it looks great. So let's get it started. So light up my alcohol burner here. It's not a big enough flame for starters. I need some cooling in there too before I pump these to start working. First run though. It's not bad. Just getting the air out of the water jacket. Needs more heat, or I need to adjust the piston a little bit. Get a little bit more power. Yeah, so it might be the piston needs adjusted, a little, or the diaphragm needs adjusted a little bit. The stroke on it. So. But it is running, so that's good. Sounds like the um, the steel wool inside the displacer rubs a good bit. Maybe sounds like a little bit more than the steel wool might be rubbing. Oh, I think it's pumping water now. Yep, it's pumping some water. That's good. New water pump works good, so that's nice. Yeah, that got a lot of power. Just needs adjusted, I think. See, the diaphragm doesn't look like it's getting the full pressure. So I think I just need to adjust the stroke a little bit, and I should be, or add more heat so that I get more air. So if I stop it for a little bit and let it heat up down there, it might be able to. 
go a little faster. It's very quiet, so that's good. Yeah, it's got a fair amount. Not a lot. But... Alright, so I think I'm going to pause it and I'll get the natural gas um, burner out and we'll power it up with that for a little bit. Alright, so let's light the natural gas up. So I've got my na nice natural gas burner out. Sometimes it's hard to light. It's probably got to get natural gas into the line. There we go. You can hear the sound change. There we go. It's probably way too high. Just the airflow there. That's probably good. Maybe a little too high. I don't know if I should get it glowing red hot for its first test on the natural gas or not. Probably too much air. Yeah, the flame doesn't look quite right. It's alright. Alright, so it just actually turned on its own a little bit there. Let's give it a good start here. Flame's kind of wobbling around here now. Ah, that's better. That's more like it. I'll get a little bit of smoke off the displacer. Burning some of the yuck off. So that's good. Oh yeah, it's running better now. Oh yeah. Sounds a lot more like what it should sound like. It's very quiet. I like it. I really like it. Let's see how much... Oh yeah, that's got a lot more power than any of the other ones. I mean, not a ton, but, I mean, it's my, my most powerful engine by far. Get a screwdriver or something if you guys can. I mean, I'm, I'm pressing pretty hard on that flywheel. It's not a small flywheel either. Let's check the displacer. here. It's not glowing yet, so I think we should turn it up just a little bit more. You can get much more power out. Sounds very happy though. I need to stop the frame from wobbling. It's got a good bit of um, wobble to it there. <laughs> yeah, I might need to get a stronger brace here for it. Or I probably need a counterbalance on the um, flywheel there. But yeah, it's really wobbling. It's wobbling the whole bench. Hope it doesn't break that off. <laughs> Might break the screws. Although I put five screws in it, so it should be alright. <laughs> it's gonna wobble itself apart. <laughs> it's really going. I think we should turn the gas down a little bit. <laughs> I don't want to ruin it. It's gonna shake itself to bits. Yeah, that's running real nice. Oh yeah, this is good. <laughs> see how powerful it is now. Mm, it's got a good bit. I just need to get a generator now hooked up to it and see how much power it can actually put out. Let's see how much water it's pumping. Tighten this up. That's perfect. Alright. I'm pumping one. I don't know. Oh, not bad. The higher RPM might not let the water circulate very well. Let's turn this down. Turn it off and see how long it runs for. Next video, I'll have to hook up a generator and we'll see how much power it puts out. So I'll turn that off and it's still going. There's a little warm coming out. Not bad. Not bad at all. I'm quite happy. Lost water cooling there.
Yes. This is awesome. You guys don't know how excited I am. This is amazing. Looks great. Makes a very nice sound. Might need to fix the, um, re redo the, um, diaphragm, because it does seem to have a bit of wasted power there, um, when it flaps like that, so, I don't know. I also need to adjust this and get the optimum performance out of it, um, for the temperature, because for a lower temperature, there's going to be less air, um, moving in and out of here, so that means that I could move this down and it would still run. Um, but for a higher temperature, you'd want to move it up a little bit, but not so much that the piston wouldn't work. That's it. That's it, folks. First running my brand new Sterling engine. So, yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching.